pretty inspired from like visual things, like when I'm making my music, so visual artists yeah. um, and like fashion and stuff like that. I feel like it, I hate when it gets separated. I like might be really enjoying the look of like a particular like photo and that'll get me in the mood to like go and make some music. That kind of like really colourful yeah. and like craziness. Or I also like really like simple, like just like outlines of things and stuff like that. a two track like single like yeah. um, released just like by myself um, a year or two ago and I was about to put out like an album of stuff because I had it all ready to go and one of my friends was like that is the dumbest thing like you can ever do no one has the attention span now to like listen through an album mm -hmm. worth of stuff and they've never heard who you are with the EP I just really wanted to get it out there that like that yeah. kind of body of work that I'd been um, working on like at the same time and I felt like it was all relevant I really wanted to like get that out of the way so I can like move forward and work on new stuff. One of my housemates, James, is an amazing producer and like jazz pianist and everything and so lately we've been doing like making some tracks together and one of my really good friends worked on heaps of stuff together which was cool because it's the first time I've actually just been in a studio with someone and from, from the very start and been like alright let's do a track together. That's like the funnest bit about music is when you get to like yeah bounce ideas off yeah. other people. Look everywhere for sounds, like um, don't get too restricted by, you know, like an 808 drum kit or something like that. Like yeah. I use a lot of like field recordings and like um, I sample stuff on my phone to use for like percussion and things yeah. like that to build my own sound. I'm just, I think I'm getting closer to making the kind of music that I hear in my head and want to, yeah, yeah want to make.